Jaipur was built as a city of art and crafts. It's a very inspiring city, whether it's the palaces, whether it's beautiful frescoes, miniature paintings. They all hold a very significant part in creation of jewellery. The history of the Gem Palace goes back as early as the history of this city. When you talk about Jaipur, the first image that comes is royalty and the Maharajas. And with Maharajas are the image of a turban bejeweled ruler, fabulously wealthy, fabulously powerful. You know, there is this bond that happens when you hold the stone for the first time. The stone is speaking to you. Something that my father had always told me that whatever we create, we have to create timeless creations. You know that jewellery is not for one generation, but it's for many generations to come. The jewellery in Jaipur uh, is still made how it was made centuries ago, which is usually handcrafted and each and every piece is made from the scratch by hand and no modern tools or machinery are being used. Jewellery and stone should bring you happiness. Natural diamonds, I would say, symbolises the incredible history and the regal legacy of our times and culture. Diamond has played an important role in my life and I feel honoured to take this tradition forward.